do not listen to people that come and tell you that you can't do something. If you want to be that one in eight billion, you've got to work for it. You have already come this far. Why give in when it gets hard? Why? You're not a failure. It's all in the mind, I guess. It's all, it's all about how you take it. If you feel that you can do something, don't think about how. Don't think about what you're doing currently and how you're going to stop. Just decide what you're going to do. It's not easy, you know, and I think if it was easy, everybody would be, would be successful. So if you want to be that, you know, person, whatever your aim is, whatever your like, goal is, you need to bring that, you know, and, 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 and I keep saying as well, and against anything, motivation isn't good enough. You need to be self-motivated. If there is somebody else motivating you and you try to achieve that, that's fake. It's, it's, it's not true. You need to bring that energy from your chest by yourself. And then only you become the, you know, then you become not everybody. You'll be somebody. And if you want to, and that's the difference. Because the population of the earth is 8 billion. And if you want to be that one in 8 billion, you've got to work for it. Stop waiting for the right time. The right time is now. Take it now. Work now. Be creative. Be strong. Be successful. We can achieve stuff way beyond what we imagine. We've been conditioned on this with this system to believe that we're just here to get up, we grow up, we get a job, we die, we, you know, we, we're in the great, it's over. We, we, we retire, we do all this rubbish, and that's it. We're not taught that we're amazing, we're powerful, we're intelligent way beyond our belief. There's always someone who don't believe in your vision. They don't matter. You know, it could be parents, it could be your closest friends. They don't matter. All that matters is what you believe, what you think of yourself. So you've got to create your own story. You've got to create your own vision. You've got to create your own plan, and then you've got to be the boss. We are the boss of our own lives, our own destiny, everything. Do not listen to people that come and tell you that you can't do something. Falling down is an accident, but staying down? is a choice. It's okay to fail. It's okay to fall. It's okay to lose. But it is not okay to quit. It is not okay to give up. It is not okay. You are better than that. You are not a quitter. You have more within you to give. This can't be it. It's okay. It's okay to fail. It's okay. Because failure ain't that until you give up. Failure is a learning lesson. We need to reframe our belief about failure. Reframe it and put a different story behind it and watch it empower you and to, and, and to, stop, and to stop freezing you up because that's what failure does. When you look at yourself as a failure, you're frozen. You're not a failure. We're human. We make mistakes. But as long as you don't repeat that mistake again, you're done. And if you repeat that mistake again and again, then you're stupid. In life, we can't escape anything that goes on with life. You know, we are not immune to problems, or drama, or trauma, or tragedy. You know, we all uh, here as human beings. I'll tell you, sometimes we go through things, yeah? People are gonna be listening to this and they, they know they're gonna go through stuff and they're gonna think, why? But you don't know the future. And the bad stuff we think have come to break us and kill us and stop us and people mess up and wanna commit suicide and end their life and they don't know the great future that they had if they could only get through the shit that they're going through. I would never say like today I'm tired, you know, today it's raining and I, you know how cold it is in winter and all that, you know, it's, it's frosty, there's it's snow, there's all that, but I never kind of you know, had an excuse saying that, oh, I'm, I'm too tired today or I'm like, you know, it's snowing or it's raining because if I say I'll do it, I'll do it and it's also about being disciplined. 
and people say yeah you require a discipline but then just being disciplined is not good enough you need to be self-disciplined and that's only when you achieve the, you know, the bigger stuff I guess don't give up on your pursuit because of setbacks don't stop because of failures don't quit because it is getting hard success comes at a price and you must be willing to pay it this storm will pass and when it does if you are still standing you will be stronger for it don't quit you are already hurting why stop now you have already come this far why give in when it gets hard why you know what come on then bring what you have that kind of an attitude you cannot change you can but you just like you come with a positive energy and see like okay show me then what what can stop me it's all in the mind i guess and it's so it's all about how you take it you've got a special place on this planet what you do there's loads of people doing it but not like you not like you and not like you you do it your way and that's what i want people to understand there's no one on the planet like you no one. They, got, they ain't got your DNA. They ain't got your fingerprints. They, can't, they haven't got your tone, the way you do things. They're not like you. So you can't decide to throw in the towel and, and, and get, out, get out the game of life. You can't do that. You're robbing us of what you've been given, what's hidden inside you. There's a hidden leader in all of us. There's gifts in all of us. Why don't we tap into it? Don't say, why me? Say, try me. Stop wishing it was easier. Wish you were better. Hey, I almost wasn't here, you know, so why I have to worry about what someone else said that could hurt me and deteriorate me from becoming who I want to be. The rewards for doing bad things are not wonderful. Count the costs, broken families, broken homes, um, death. Uh, jail time, uh, people just wasted their lives with a messed up mind. The cost of giving up. We run away from it all. So how are we going to share the experience and empower other people if we keep running or we want to take our life and bloody do ourselves in? Bro, you, we've got massive stories to help others. We don't, this is a messed up world with beautiful people. It's in our control to reframe our story. Why do we buy the story that we're given? Why do we give up on this gift called life so easily and allow the pain to stop us from moving on into our great future, man? We got this, we got control. We're a special creation and we give up and we throw it away so easy. That's why I can't give up and I can't throw it away because I realize that I'm special, that I'm made by a special power. And we all are, every single one of us. Look at the gift that you lot have got. We all got choice. Imagine if we all made the choice to live for good. If we all decide to live like that, what a planet, bro.